Those stories in just a moment, but we begin with new developments today in court regarding the Cy Ridge High School students accused of plotting to kill their fellow classmates. Good evening, I'm Bill Baessa. Hello, I'm Dominique Soxa. Earlier today, we learned that Tony Warner and Seth Phillips allegedly brought knives to school to carry out that horrific act. Channel 2's Keith Garvin spoke with Warner's stepdad, and Keith, we understand that he had some shocking thoughts about who was actually behind this plot. Bill Dominique Warner's stepfather is pointing the finger at the other young man involved. Either way, both teens face some serious charges that accuse them of wanting to harm their fellow classmates here at Cy Ridge High School. Two high school students who have more than classes and homework to worry about. Tony Warner and Seth Phillips, both 17 and both students at Cy Ridge High School, were in court today charged with conspiracy to commit murder. The two are accused of making a plan to take knives to school to kill classmates. Investigators said they found knives as well as a list of written chores that included gather weapons, get money, and identify people to kill. We went by Warner's home. His family wouldn't talk on camera, but his stepfather told me off camera that Phillips is the one behind the trouble. Neighbors say they never expected something like this to hit so close to home. It's all around the country is going on, and uh, but like I said, you know, here this is this is surprised me. This surprised me. We also went by Phillips' residence, but were unable to track down him or his family. Both teens are out of jail now, but have been sent to alternative school and have to wear ankle monitors. And court documents also revealed that Warner and Phillips allegedly referred to themselves as Murder Inc. Their next court appearance is scheduled for March. Reporting live from Cyber Ridge High School, Keith Garvin, KPRC Channel 2 News.